Day two of the Republican National Convention is underway in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. And that's where we find Valley News Team's Ethan Kramer, who joins us live with an update of what's gone down so far and what we can expect coming up. Hi, Ethan. Yeah, Tatum, it was an absolutely electric day one at the RNC. Former President Trump made his first public appearance since the assassination attempt on Saturday, and J.D. Vance was named as his running mate. I spoke with former Speaker of the House, Representative Newt Gingrich, who told me he's very impressed by Vance and that he looks forward to debates with Kamala Harris. I did also speak with former Republican presidential candidate Vivek Ramaswamy, and he told me that he can tell how hungry the people are to reunite the country. Well, now for the state of North Dakota, Doug Burgum is not on the list to speak today, but we also spoke with Senator Kevin Kramer yesterday, and he told us that he called President Trump Saturday a couple hours after the assassination attempt, wishing him his best and that him and his wife are thinking about him. So Tatum, a lot of storylines from day one as we head into do and to day two as that is scheduled to begin at 5 p.m. Reporting from the RNC, Ethan Kramer, Valley News Live. That live update, Ethan, and good luck heading into day two as the festivities begin tonight. And as a reminder, Valley News Live will be giving you live updates from the convention all week long.